Good evening, everyone. How are you doing? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Okay. Welcome to the class. Okay, let's begin. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. This is the English for Work program, beginner for. Welcome to your English class. Today is Wednesday, September the 27th. This is class eight. Tonight's topic is May and May. This is the general objective. Class This is the specific objective. And this is the class objective. Participants will be able to express dissatisfaction about a product they bought online. Okay. And uh, this is the agenda. Okay. The first thing is satisfaction. How do we express satisfaction? Next, we're going to work on the introduction to May and Might. Then we're going to practice May and Might, and we're going to divide it into possibility and permission. And then uh, we're going to finish with future possibility. Okay, so this is tonight. But before that, let's go to the attendance. Let's go to the attendance. Good evening. Good evening. Hey. Let's see. Uh, Adán Antonio Ramírez. Blanca del Carmen Santos. Present teacher, good night. Good evening, good evening. Good evening, good evening. <laughs> yes. Carlos Amilcar Campos. Present teacher. Excellent. Welcome on board. Cecilia Maribel Alemán. Present teacher. Okay, nice. Daniel Enrique Sifontes. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Edgar Edilson Reyes. Edwin Alexis Pérez. Edwin Alfredo Alcón. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Esmeralda del Rosario Portillo. Gabriela Yamilet Ramírez. Gisela Guadalupe Martínez. Gladys Rubín, Rubidia Nieto. Jonathan Stanless Perez. Present teacher. Good evening. Excellent. Good evening. Jose Daniel Cermeño. Jose Ernesto Alemán. Present teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Nice. Ken, Kendi Natalia Sánchez. Mario Cristóbal Quintanilla. Present. Excellent. Nice. Mario Germán González. Mauricio yes, Antonio sir. Rivera. Okay. Welcome on board. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Miguel Ángel Cortés. Here, teacher. Excellent. Nice. Noé Aníbal González. And Sergio Adolfo Hernández. Present, teacher. Excellent. Nice. Okay. Let's be. Let's see. The first thing that we're going to be doing is thinking about satisfaction. How do people express satisfaction? What do the people say when they want to express satisfaction?
satisfaction. For example, they ask the they ask uh, people's opinion. What do you think about our service? What do you think about our service? And then people may say, I really like it. Because it's very complete. Or they say, I love it. It's really good. I think it's excellent. In my opinion, it's great. I just love it. Okay, satisfaction, dissatisfaction. How can people express dissatisfaction? They can say, I really find it incomplete. I guess it could be better. Tell you the truth, I hate. Okay. <laughs> it could be better. Okay, so satisfaction. How do we express satisfaction? What do you think about our service? I really like it because it's very complete. I love it. It's really good. I think it's excellent. In my opinion, it's great. I just love it. Okay, that is satisfaction. We say dissatisfaction. Let me see, I'm going to move it down a little bit here place here, dissatisfaction. To express dissatisfaction, people say, I really find it incomplete. I guess it could be better. To tell you the truth, I hate it. It could be better, okay? So this is expressing satisfaction. Okay. Let's see. Some people ask, how was the last purchase you made? Okay. Kitty says you did. How was the last purchase? Because these are copied from the from the book. How was the last purchase you made? Were you satisfied or dissatisfied? Okay. Was the customer satisfied or dissatisfied? Is satisfaction important? Okay. So here we have ideas. How many of you buy online? Do you buy online? No, teacher, in my case, I don't buy. You don't buy online. You don't buy online. <laughs> Me, no, teacher. Okay. So, nobody buys online. Why not? 
Don't you like the service? Or do you think that is uh, they give you a bad service? Or is it too dangerous? What's your opinion about uh, shopping online? For me, teacher, it's uh, afraid because uh, it's dangerous. I I think that um, it's dangerous because I don't know the other people. Is is easy that um, estafa swindled. They, yeah, you can get yes. ripped off. Mm -hmm. Yeah, or, or or stole. Yeah, I'm going to put here uh, get ripped off. And I don't have money. <laughs> uh -huh, okay, yeah. It's I true. don't have money too. It's, it's expensive, a lot of products. Yeah, it's true. Many things are expensive. And if you lose the money, um no yeah it's true i agree with you definitely it's a risk even though yes. now with cyber security things are different and it's safer to buy online but in the past it was really bad you easily it, got ripped off in other countries maybe is is more security it's safer Safe, say yes. Safer in other countries. Could be, could be. Yeah, maybe safer in in other countries, not here. Okay. So all your purchases are made uh, in, let's say, in store. So you have in store purchases. Yes, you go to the stores to buy. They are not online. They are in store. Okay. When was the last time that you went shopping? When was the last time that you went shopping to a store? Okay. The last time was uh -huh. uh, last weekend. Last weekend. And what did you buy? I, I visit uh, my Mike. You visited my Mike. I Mike. bought a uh, back. <clears throat> backpack. A backpack. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. And uh, were you satisfied with the product? Yes. Yes, I satisfied. That's right. Mike, Mike has very good uh, backpack. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay. Uh, the ones that they call Alpinas. Okay. Alpinas. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They're expensive. But they are. Yes. <laughs> they are well, expensive, but they are well made. They are well made. Okay. Thank you for sharing. Somebody else? When was the last time you went shopping in a store and what did you buy? In my case, uh, car tires, car tires. Car tires, okay. Yes, a do, pair. You, do you buy them new or second hand? Uh, in this in this time was, was new. They were new? Uh -huh. Yes. Okay, are you satisfied with the purchase? Yes, because uh, the tire has a discount. Dis a discount. Discount. A discount. Yes. Uh huh. Um, the second and um, fifty percent. Oh, 50. really? Yes, fifty okay. percent. And what size are your tires? Um, size. Size. The the ring. Uh mm huh. -hmm. Uh, sixteen. 16. Yes. Okay. Yeah, the last time I bought tires, I bought them second hand. Uh, I paid $60 for each and it's ring 18. Okay. Ring 18. Uh, 
I bought them in 2020. I have the the, the the second the second hand, but the second hand. Mm -hmm. but uh, best best tires, best tires, good okay. tires, good yes. tires. Yes, the, in the, the second com, hand. Second hand. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I bought them second hand. I only checked uh, that the surface of the tire were had the tracks well made, and uh, yeah, they were good. Well, I need to change them this year. I will yeah. have to change the four tires. They are not bad yet. I mean, but they are old. So from 2020, before the, pan the pandemic, it's true that they were two years that they didn't roll, right? 2020 and 2021, they were at home. <laughs> In, in in other in other years I had a, a customer mm -hmm. that he he sell tires mm -hmm. the second He's... hand but mm -hmm. uh, good tires good tires and uh -huh. and cheap cheap tires cheap tires yes okay. excellent no I need to I need to find a good second hand tires and cheap too <laughs> because there isn't much money but in, in december i need to change them uh -huh. definitely okay okay excellent thank you for sharing thank you for sharing. You're welcome. yes okay somebody else when was the last time you went shopping and what did you buy In my case, I had a lot of uh, a lot of time that I don't bought anything. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. So you haven't gone shopping in a long time. Okay. Yes. Thank you, Mielit. Thank you very much okay. for okay. sharing. Okay, then let's let's move on. Read a survey about a customer's experience with a product. Okay, this is what John Doe said. Don Joe, uh, John Doe, no, Don Joe, no. John Doe said. The first question, how satisfied are you with this product? And he said, be satisfied. Rate, rate your opinion about the product quality. High quality, average, low quality, very low quality. Okay, let me see if I have uh, forms to insert. No, probably I don't have forms to insert. Okay, but forms like that. No, I don't have tires. Oh, polygons, no. The polygons are really bad. So, but imagine that you have stars. How many stars are usually given? Let me see. Imagine that these are stars. Five stars, high quality. Okay. Average, three stars. Now four, let's say three stars, yes. Low quality, two stars. Very low quality, one star. Okay. And then he gave only one star. The value of this product is poor. Okay, the value is poor. Okay, um, and then will you continue using this product? And he says, no, 
No. Okay. Let's see. Over here, I ask you this. Is the word rate clear for you? Is the word rate clear for you? Yes? Mm, not, not really, right? Okay. Sometimes, sometimes you go to the App Store. You go to the App Store, and in the App Store, you download... Uh, and obviously an app <laughs> you download an app right so you start using it and they ask you please rate our app give us five stars so what you are when you rate an app what you are saying is the app is good the app is hmm, average or the app is bad. So that is rate. To rate is to give a ranking, a ranking mm -hmm. whether something is classified as excellent, very good, good, needs improvement, <laughs> right? bad. So that is the ranking. That is to do that, to classify it is to rate, to classify the quality of the product or to classify the product under different, uh, let's say, rankings. So you can say uh, rate, to rate the product. I don't know if I explained it clear. Yes, get the idea. Yes. Yes. I understand. yes, teacher. Yes. Oh, okay. Excellent. Yes, have teacher. You ever, have you ever rated? Have you ever rated uh, an app? Have you ever expressed your opinion about an app? Like, for example, uh, the games that I play on my cell phone are only three types of games. Number one is quiz, quiz games about general culture, or the other one is solitaire, and the last one is crossword. Ah, there is one, they give you three letters. They give you three letters, like, uh, for example, they give you or four letters, depending on the situation. Like they, they put the letters like this. Okay, they put like. In apps, teacher, it's very common. Uh, give give uh, rates. I had rate the application, right? Yes, yes, it's common. In games. In games. <laughs> <clears throat> so one of the things that I do is this. Look, we have yeah. what word do you see here? Okay. Art. So I have what I have to do is make words. Yeah, and I make the word art. Rat. <laughs> star. Or what other word can I use with that one? Art, rat, tar. Tar is the one that you find in tobacco. Well, not in tobacco, but in cigarettes. You have tar, it's alquitran, tar. And then rat, you know what a rat is, and art. So we have three letters and we make words. So that is the other game. So this is a, another another game. So those are the four types of games that I play. So then I uh, they ask me to rate 
to rate the game. And so I, I do it. I mean, I like that type of game. So have you ever rated an app? Have you ever expressed your opinion about an app? In my case, never. Never, <laughs> never. never. Uh, Only I use the app. <laughs> use the app, but you don't you don't rate yeah. it. Okay. Yeah. It's it's also valid. It's also valid. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. I usually express my satisfaction mm -hmm. with the app. Like for example. Okay. What things do you think make a good app? What what characteristics are good in an app? that the app is picture in my case i have in my cell phone uh -huh. an app is about the holy bible ah, and yes. it's very very excellent because it's in order all the books to the mm -hmm. bible yes. and i have ha, um has um yes. Quiz about the 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 Bible history. Uh -huh. Is it green? Yeah. Is the app green? Is no. Is um brown. Brown. Ah, okay. Yes. Yeah. It's because if you look by the name, you have several apps of the Bible, and then you can read them. Very interesting. And yes. 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 So they ask you to rate the app. And that's very good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Just that. Just that one. Okay. Excellent. Yes, I have. I also have uh, Bibles there. Okay. You see? Yes. And also apps for learning English. There are a lot of apps for learning English. For reading, for listening. Ah, Duolingo. Ah, Duolingo. Yeah. Duolingo is a good app. It's a good app. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. I, I use Google Translator. No, Google Translator is fantastic. Definitely, yes. Mm -hmm. And there is an app for Google Translator. Right? It has yes. a symbol. I don't know what symbols those are, Chinese or Japanese. I don't know. Together. Like combination. This. Combination. <laughs> ah, yeah. There. Interesting. Yeah. yeah, very interesting. Yeah. All right, let's move on. Let's continue. Read the information again to answer the questions compared with a partner. Okay, first, how was the customer's experience? Good or bad? Bad experience. Bad experience. How do you express... Yes. How do you express bad in an emoticon? Like this? Or they put it like this, right? Like this or like this? They use this hand. No, I don't know. But they, I don't know how they use it because it's the hand like that. Teacher, uh, yes? there are uh, an interference. Another conversations. Yeah, I think that so microphone. Other Mic microphone is open. Yeah, other microphones are open. Okay. Let me see. Okay. So then, uh, how do you express that something is good, like this, or like this? The first one or the second? The first one, teacher. The first one, right? Good. So the experience of the customer was how? Like this or like this? The first or the second? The second. The second. Mm -hmm. So we say it was bad. It was bad. Okay. 
Is the product a good one or a bad one? Bad one. It's a bad one, right? Of this bad one. It's a bad product. It's a bad product. Okay. Now the question over here. What do you think are the possible reasons for the product to be bad? We don't know, we don't know what product it is. Let's think about a specific product so that we can give ideas. A cell phone. Imagine that it's a cell phone. Everybody needs a cell phone. So the cell phone was a bad one. Okay, what were the possible reasons? Mm -hmm. Maybe it was a very low quality. Okay, it was low quality. Okay. Mm -hmm. Probably it was poorly made. What's, what's the meaning? Was poorly made. The products were bad. I mean, the materials. Materials were bad. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. What can be another possibility? For the. It was a price teacher. Would you please repeat? Price teacher? Ah, uh, maybe the price was. So you say that it was too expensive. Could it be? It was very expensive. And it was pajarit. Okay. Yeah, because when it's a dummy phone, it's not a smartphone, but it's a dummy phone. If it's expensive, we say, mm, no, it's not worth it. If it's a smartphone, ah, well, that's a different thing, right? Smartphone, okay? So it was expensive, was poorly made, it was low quality. Okay, so probably those were the reasons why the, the person was dissatisfied, okay? But operative system, uh-huh, exactly. It was too slow. It was very slow. Okay. It was very slow. Mm -hmm. It didn't have much memory. Right? It didn't have... didn't have much memory. The, op the operative system was old fashioned. Or out of date. Um, no door on. Oh, okay. It was broken. It was broken. All right. When it says it was broken, the first thing that comes to your mind is the screen was open, was broken. Not necessarily. It was broken means that you try to turn it on, but it doesn't turn on. For, it, for whatever reason, it doesn't turn on. Maybe because it, the battery is dead or maybe because the button doesn't make the connection or the system is dead. If the system is down, impossible, okay? Excellent. Very good. Now let's continue. So this is talking about satisfaction, satisfaction. Here we were talking about a person that was dissatisfied with a cell phone because it was low quality. 
It was poorly made. It was very expensive. It didn't have much memory. Uh, the operative system was obsolete, was out of date. So therefore, the telephone was very slow. So, and later the telephone was broken. Okay. So you can say something like that. All right. Now we move to May and Might. May and Might. Okay. What do we use May and Might for? Two principal things. Okay. Let's put them here. May. Might. Principal things. First, I'm going to have to do it the other way around. Okay. Permission. The second is possibility. May and might, permission, possibility. Okay, permission. You ask for permission. May I go out? May I go out? Okay, possibility. Uh, she might be busy now. She might be busy now. So, permission. May I go out? Possibility. She might be busy now. Okay. What's the meaning of possibility? Teacher, I don't understand what's the meaning of possibility. Possibility is that something may, may be or may not be true. Maybe it's true, maybe it's not true. We don't know. It's a possibility. It's possible. It can be true, but we don't know for sure. Right? So that is possibility. What's permission? Permission is when Someone in authority says we can do something. <coughs> Imagine that your mom, your mom says, you may go to the party. That is what? Permission. My mom says, I may go to the party. May I go to the bathroom? Teacher. Ah, exactly. <laughs> May I go to the bathroom? May I go to the restroom? Okay. You say, May I so go teacher, out? Teacher. Yes. Other oh, is the teacher might need drink water. Oh, yeah, Tanchula. Yes, of course, God. <laughs> it's true. No, no, it's the teacher might not. I mean, might need. No, the teacher needs. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Yes, that's true. Mm -hmm. So in that case, that is permission. May I go out? May I may I eat something? Etc. We're going to be checking those in a moment. The possibility. Hey, what are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. Um I might stay home or I might go out, means nothing. I mean, you are not sure, right? You don't know. So you say, mm, I might go out or I might stay home. I don't know, right? That is possible. I don't know. I might go out or I might stay home, okay? Possibility. Not is something that is coincidental, probably coincidental, when you ask a question for permission, you never use might. My I go out now. What do you use? 
May. May, right? May. May I go out? May I eat something? Uh, may I tell you something? Okay, so may. And might, we use it for possibility. The two express permission and the two express possibility. But for questions, we use may. Okay. Now, check over here. Examples. I may ask for a refund. For a refund. Sorry, refund. I may ask for a refund. Peter, what's a refund? Refund is when I pay for something, I'm not satisfied, and I ask for my money. H, here is the product. Give me the money. The product is not good. No, no. Please give me my money. That is a refund. I'm asking for a refund. Means give me my money back. Return the money to me. <laughs> Give me my money back. So I'm asking for a refund. So here it says, I may ask for a refund. This is pronounced may, like in my may. May. And this is pronounced might. Like in my trito, right? So might. May. Might, may, might, may, might, may, mm -hmm. may, might. <laughs> okay, so we have, I may ask for a refund. You may buy a diff at a different store. You may buy at a different store. They may not provide a good service. They may not provide a good service. I may not reach it, sorry, it may not reach your expectations. It may not live up to your expectations. Normally, normally we say live up to. It may not live up to your expectations. What's in Spanish? Ooh, not even near not even close, we say llenar las expectativas, right? So, but over here in English, we say live up to. It may not live up to your expectations. It may not live up to your expectations. Okay, so that would be the idea. Now, the other example here is she might want a refund on those units. They might complain, uh, sorry, no complaint, no complaint, complain. So I'm going to put a, um, well, let me see, I'm going to erase that part. Why, teacher? I'm going to explain the difference between the two words. But first, I'm going to make a correction. Let me see. Oops, I went back here. It's um, it's a mistake. I'm going to say like this. Um, let me see white. Okay, so I put here a, to eliminate the T. So bye bye T. Bye bye T. And nothing happened. Okay, um, what's the difference between complain and complaint? And what's the meaning of complain? Check over here, complain. Complain is a verb. It's a verb. You say, I'm going to complain, right? I'm going to complain because complain is a verb. 
they might complain about the service. Now, complaint. Complaint with a T. Complaint with a T. What's this? This is a noun. Noun. Really, teach. Yeah, it's a noun. You say like, there were a lot of complaints. There were a lot of complaints. A lot of chaos, right? There were a lot of complaints. So, I'm going to put here the example with the noun. There were a lot of complaints. Yeah, and I'm going to put the other form. People complained. And I'm going to use the past tense. Okay, people complained. People complained. Because complain is a verb. Complaint is a noun. There were a lot of complaints. People complained. All right, then the next one. So they might complain about the service. We might ask to talk with the supervisor. Uh, well, maybe. Normally, people ask to talk about who? The manager, right? People normally ask to talk to the manager. May I please talk to the manager? Okay. He might not buy here again. He might not buy here again. Okay, people talk to, well, you say not talk to, but they speak to the manager. We might ask to speak to the manager. Speak to, not talk with. Talk with is, hey, hello, how are you? Nice to see you. What's, okay, my friend, hello, talk. But this is speak with speak to the manager. Very angry, right? So that is a difference. All right. So these are examples. Do you have any questions about the examples? Yes, Miguelito. Uh, my, my don't use with the uh, I. Ah, okay, yes, I might, I might. Okay. I yeah. don't see you here. <laughs> Aha, exactly, <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. In a moment, we're going to have more it's, examples. It's, I might, yes. I might. Uh -huh. Check over here. When we are not sure about something in the present or future, we say, Jack may be coming to see us tomorrow. Perhaps Jack will come to see us tomorrow. Maybe, we don't know. It's a possibility only. Oh boy, that's a British expression. Oh boy, right? Oh boy, it's half past 10. We may be late for the meeting. Perhaps we will be late for the meeting, right? Perhaps. She's had no sleep. She may be tired. Another thing is she hasn't slept. She may be tired. Perhaps she's tired. Maybe she's tired. It's a possibility. I might see you tomorrow. My see you teacher. No, my see you no. It's my see you. No, my see you. Okay, so I might see you tomorrow. I might see you tomorrow. Maybe I will see you tomorrow. And then I might see you. I might see you. Where are my, I might see you. No, I might see you, right? No, I might see you. No, I might see you, okay? And uh, the sky is a little dark. The sky is a little dark. It might rain tonight. What's the meaning? Maybe it will rain. Betty may go with you if you ask her, okay? So these are some of the examples. Okay, here are examples that I will ask volunteers to read. But before we get to these ones, 
let me explain a little more about this. Okay. May, might. Okay. May, might. Okay, first permission. You help me. We say, may I eat here? May I eat her? No. May I eat her? No. May I eat here? Okay. No, may I eat her? You watch it, may I eat her? The monster or vampire? Okay, so may I eat her? Now, may I eat here? Yes, you may. Yes, you may. Or no, right? No, you may not. No, you may not. No, you may not. Teacher, but some people say, can I? Can I eat here? Is that permission too? Yes. Can I eat here is permission. But which is better? May I? May I is better. You can say, can I? Can I eat here? But the best or the better in this case, we consider two is may I, okay? So yeah. what more, else? Sorry? Let more polite. Me... Yeah, that's more polite. Okay. Hey, may I go now? May I go home now? May I go home now? May I talk to you for a while? May I talk to you for a moment? What other permission can we ask? What other permission can we ask? Excuse me. Sorry? Excuse me, yeah, you, you can begin with excuse me. Excuse me, may I, what? Might. May, no, might, in that case, might, no. Only may for the question. What can we ask? May I? Or may we? May we wait here? May we wait here? May we? What? May we take a break? May we take a break now? Permission. Possibility. Ah, but with possibility with, I mean, permission with might. Check. My mom says I may go out with you. Okay. Ah, okay. But we say says may. But what happens if it's past tense? Okay, we say my mom said I might go out with you. My mom said I might. So this is important that we pay attention to, okay? It's very important to pay attention to this. Says, may. Said, might. Teacher, is that permission? Yes, because the two subjects are different. The first subject is giving permission to the second subject. My mom is giving permission, right? Is giving me permission. My mom says I may go out with you. My mom said I might go out with you. 
Another example. The teacher says, we may go home. The teacher says, we may go home now. The teacher says, we may, teacher says, no say, right? Says, the teacher says, we may go home now. Okay, the other example. The teacher said, what? The teacher said, we, what? Uh -huh. What do we use in this case? Might. Might, right? Exactly. We might. The teacher said we might go home now. Okay. Excellent. All of these are permission. Permission. Okay. Permission. Teacher, can you send that to the WhatsApp? Yes, of course. I'm going to cut it from here, so. Wow, calculated, did it. So here we go. Okay, now my dear Angelitos, B. B. You want me to say just B? Possibility. Possibility. Okay, here. I'm going to move this one. And I'm going to put here B, possibility. Okay, what are you going to do tonight? The, the answer can be, I don't know. I might. Go to bed early. I don't know. I might go to bed early. What are you going to do tomorrow morning? Um, I wake might... up very fast. Uh, sorry? Repeat, please. Wait, wake up very fast. Oh, okay. <laughs> I might wake up very early mm -hmm. i might wake up very early okay when you get up like this you say wake up with a start it's an english expression it means wake up with a start wake up with a start normally Normally, you say wake up with a start, meaning despertar con sobresalto, right? Wake up with a start. Usually after an alarm clock, there is the alarm clock, and you wake up with a start. Okay? So I might wake up very early. What are you going to do tomorrow afternoon? What can we answer? What can we answer? I might go 
I might drink a coffee. Oh, I might drink coffee with friends. I might drink coffee with friends. What are you going to do next Saturday? You say, I, uh, I don't know. I may. Uh -huh. I, I may. Yeah, you can say I may. I don't know. I may what? Go to the church. I may go to church. Yes. In this case, it should be, I will go to church. <laughs> I'm going to go to church, right? But in this case, we say, I don't know. I don't know. I may, I may go to church. I don't know. I may go to church. Okay. So this is the way we use possibility. Hey, what are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. Uh, I might go to work. The most common, most common is might. May is second more common, but the most common is might. Most people use might. Might, 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 might. Okay, let's see. For example, uh, Maria is pregnant. What is she going to have? I don't know. It might be a baby. Come on, it's going to be a baby. No, what is it going to be? I don't know. Might be a boy, might be a girl. <laughs> there are only two options, right? Might be a girl, might be a boy, but we don't know. Okay. So okay, that would be the, the idea, possibility. Okay, my dear Angelitos, let me send you, let me send you this one. Okay, the teacher ate payasitos today. So let me see. Um doesn't want to let me okay. what do you say perhaps like this no okay. I will have to do it like this because it doesn't let me do it like this okay so you have the other part here at the other part here. Okay. So, pos continue with possibilities. One volunteer to read uh, these examples. Who would like to read them? Me, teacher. Thank you, Edwin. Okay. Possibility. Both my, both my and might may can and be might. used. Mm -hmm. May and might can be used to express possibility. Some examples. It might rain tonight. Hmm? She might not come to the meeting. I might need I your may, help. I, I may, may mm -hmm. need your help on this project. Yeah. He may be waiting for us. Hmm? Jack may be a bit busy. Busy. But B busy. Busy. Mm -hmm. busy. But he may help you. Mm -hmm. I might change my my mind my mind at the last minute. Mm -hmm. I might change my mind at the last minute. I may change my opinion, right? So the last minute. Okay, excellent. Possibility. Possibility. So this would be the idea. Okay. Now, continue with the uses of may and might. Who would like to read this one? One volunteer to read. Me? Yes, please, me a little, go ahead. To ask for permission in a formal way. May I borrow the car tomorrow? May we come a bit later? Later? 
later to give permission in a formal way. You may go now. You may come at 11 if you wish. Excellent. So you see permission in, in both. Asking, may I borrow the car tomorrow? May we come a bit later? Or to give permission, hey, you may, you may go now. Or you may come at 11 if you wish. Okay? So those would be the idea. Okay, one more volunteer to read this box. Me, teacher. Yes, please, Gabby. We use mind when we are not sure about something in the present or future. I might see you tomorrow. It mm -hmm. looks nice, but but it might be very expensive. 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 Mm -hmm. It's quite bright. I might, it might not not rain today. It might not rain. It might not rain today. Okay. Excellent. Thank you very much. Notice. I might see you again. I might see. You. I might see you tomorrow, okay? I might see you. All right. So we're going to come back to this later, okay? To write examples with both. But first, let's go to this. Okay, this is what we were doing. Okay. So we'll do to this, and uh, we're going to practice. Okay. So... What are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. I don't know. So say like, what are you going to do tomorrow? You say, I don't know. I might get up late. I might get up late and uh, go out in the afternoon. So, I don't know. I might get up late and go out in the afternoon. What are you going to do? You remember that to ask about plans, you use what are you going to do, right? What are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. I might get up late and go out in the afternoon. Okay. So this would be the idea. All right, now let's see. Possibility and permission. To practice possibility and permission. We're going to be practicing the first possibility. What are you going to do? Tonight, I'm not sure, I might watch TV. You can say, I'm not sure, or you can say, I don't know. I don't know, right? I'm not sure, or I don't know. I might, I might watch TV. So remember, Let me see. The question. What are you going to do okay. tonight? Tomorrow morning. Tomorrow afternoon. At noon tomorrow. Next Saturday afternoon. Next Sunday. Okay. The answer. The answer. So, example. 
What are you going to do tonight? I don't know. I might watch TV. <laughs> and I didn't put the line and watch. Okay. So what are you going to do tonight? I don't know. I might watch TV. I'm not sure. I might I might watch TV. What are you going to do tomorrow morning? I don't know. I might go shopping. I might go shopping. Then I might go to the gym. I might have lunch with friends. I might play soccer. I might go to church. And these are for the questions. These are for the answers. Okay, let's go to the groups and let's practice. Let's go to the groups and let's practice with our friends. Okay. Wow, we are 20 today. I'm going to make four groups. Okay. The groups are opening. Please join. Wow, group two is complete. Group three has only two people. In group three, we have Edwin Perez, Cecilia Maribel Alemán, and Gisela Guadalupe Martinez. So Ceci and Gisela, please join group three. Group four is complete. Excellent. Hello, Sergio. Um, hello. Good evening. Ready? Ready. Um, can you see my screen? Yes. Okay. Who wants to be the first? Uh, we. Okay. What are you going to do tonight? I'm not sure. I might watch TV. Oh. What are you going to do tomorrow morning? I don't know. I might go shopping. What are you going to do tomorrow afternoon? I'm not sure. Uh, I I might go to the gym. What are you going to do at noon tomorrow? I don't know. I might have lunch with friends. What are you going to do next Saturday next Saturday afternoon? I don't know. I might play soccer. What are you going to do next Sunday? I'm not sure. I might go to church. Church. Okay. Adam and Edwin. Next. Yeah, good job. Very good. Okay. Thanks. What, Welcome. what are Oh, esa sería, esa sería entonces la, lo que vamos a practicar. No sé si lo logran ver. Yes. Entonces, vaya. Se usa, empiezo yo con don José Ernesto Alemán. Okay, okay. Yo... Pregunto y usted hace la, la respuesta. De... What are you going to do tonight? I don't know. 
Es así. I don't know or I'm not sure. Yes, así. I don't know or I'm not sure. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I might. I, I might arrest. Okay. <laughs> what are you going to do tomorrow morning? Tomorrow morning. Mm -hmm. Go to work. José, acá están las respuestas. Sí, oh, muy bien. Acá están las respuestas. Eh, por ejemplo, en la letra B eh, sería go shopping. En la C, go, go to shopping. Gym. Go to the gym. Ajá, esas son, ah, esas okay, son las respuestas. Okay, después, okay. después de la pleca está la respuesta. Thank you, sí. Ok. Yes, ajá, para la pregunta es que ocupamos la primera parte. Como Ajá, la sí. respuesta y lo que está después de la pleca. Ah, cabal. Exacto, sí. Si quieren, otra sí. vez entonces la, la segunda. Veamos otra vez en la, en la B. What are you going to do tomorrow morning? Esto voy a usar el Aymon Sur. I might go shopping. I might go shopping. Yes, ma. I mean, sí. What are you going to do tomorrow afternoon? I might go to the gym. Okay. What are you going to do at noon tomorrow? I'm not sure. I may go shopping. Go shopping. Okay. What are you going to do tomorrow afternoon? <laughs> I'm, I don't know. I might go to the gym. What are you going to do at noon tomorrow? I'm not sure. I may have a have lunch with my friends what are you do going to do next saturday afternoon i don't know i may play soccer what are you going to do soccer. next sunday i don't know I, I may go to church. I might go to church. 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 Might go to church. Okay. Good. Very good. Very good. Continue practice. Thanks, teacher. You're welcome. <laughs> okay. Gisela este va a participar. I'm not sure. I am my how long you with friends? And okay. my question, what are you going to do next on, next Saturday? I'm not sure at my play soccer. Okay. What are you doing to do next what are you Sunday? Going, going I, I am not sure at my uh, go to the church. I might go to church. Mm -hmm. I might go to church. Excellent. Nice, nice. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. That's it, teacher. 
Yes, you finished? <laughs> yes. Okay, excellent. I, I win was, that star. Yes, I was accommodating <laughs> my chair <laughs> because my, no, no. my my colita continues. No comfortable. No, no, no it's comfortable. comfortable. It isn't comfortable at all. I don't. Okay. So, we have a back to connection. Oh, okay. Don't worry. Uh, now we could hear you very well. Okay, let's go back to the main session. Okay. Okay, let's go okay. Back to okay teacher. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you, everybody. Yes. Nice. Very okay. good. Good job. We're going to be practicing permission. Okay. We're going to be practicing permission. So we're going to be asking for permission. May I? Okay. Sure. Feel free. Okay. Another word, another thing that you can say is sure. Go ahead. Go ahead. Sure, go ahead. Or no problem, right? Sure, no problem. Okay. May I go may I go out for a moment? Sure. Go ahead. May I go out for a moment? Sure. Feel free. May I take a picture of your food? Sure. Feel free. May I use your phone? Sure. Go ahead. May I do the homework now? Sure. Feel free. Okay. So you ask for permission to do these things. Go out for a moment. Take a picture of your foot. Use your phone. Do the homework now. Ask you something. Borrow your book for a while. Take one of those cookies. Read your newspaper. Or this is may I, may I. But then you will ask, may we? May we have lunch here? May we stay here during lunchtime? May we see you after class? May we get together in the hallway? May we get together in the hallway? May we, okay, may we. May I, may I, may we. Say like, May I? May I? May we? May we? May we have lunch here? May I? May we? Have lunch here, stay here during lunch time. See you after class, get together in the hallway, go out for a moment, take a picture of your food, use your phone, do the homework now, ask you something, borrow your book for a while, take one of those cookies, read your newspaper. Permission, okay, permission. You have questions about any of the things here? Hallway. Hallway. What you, hallway. Hallway what is, is hey, you are walking, you are walking in a passageway. There are rooms here, rooms here. Room, room. And then there is a passage. That's a hallway. Or if you if you're in a school, classrooms here, classrooms here. You go in the middle. Hallway. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, that would be the, the idea. Okay, any other question? All right, then let's go. Lunch. Lunch. 
Lunch time. <laughs> Lunch is at 12 o'clock, between 12 and 1 ah. p.m. Lunch. Noon. Yes, lunch. Punctual at noon. Yeah, punctual at noon. Okay. 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 The groups are opening. Please join. Let's practice. Group one, we have Edgar Reyes is in group one. Edwin Alexis Perez, group three. Cecilia is in group three. Mario Cristobal Quintanilla is in group three. Okay. Thank you for joining. Yes. Yes. Okay. Eh, ¿Alguien quiere practicar? Sí. Okay. I begin. May I go go out for a moment? Uh, sure. No. The answer Go out uh, from... sure, yes, sure, feel feel free or go ahead. I con como sería. Uh -huh. Creo que para todas las preguntas es como sure. Feel free or, or go ahead. Uh -huh. You have like, what you're going to do is you're going to ask, may, may I go out for a moment? And the other it, person, one person says, may I go out for a moment? And the other says, sure, feel free. May I take a picture? May I take a picture of your food? Sure, go ahead. May I uh, use okay. the phone? Sure, okay. Ah, okay. The answer, sure. Go ahead. May I take a picture of your food? Sure. Feel free. May I use your phone? Uh, sure. Go ahead. May I do the homework now? Sure. Feel free. May I ask ask you something? Sure, go ahead. May I borrow your book for a while? Sure, feel free. May I take one of those cookies? Sure, go ahead. May I read your your newspaper? Sure, feel feel free. Okay. May we have lunch here? Sure, no problem. May we stay here during lunch time? Sure. Go ahead. Go ahead. May we see you after class? Sure, no problem. May we get together in the hallway? Sure, go ahead. Okay, thank you. Okay. Uh, May I go out for a moment? Sure, feel free. May I take a picture of your food? Sure, go ahead. May I use for funds? Sure, feel free. May I do the homework now? Sure, go ahead. Otra, la otra parte que había puede ser a go ahead. Mm -hmm. Cualquiera Bye. de las dos. Okay. May I use your phone? Uh, sure, feel free. 
May I do the homework now? I sure can pray. May I ask you sometime? Something. I sure can pray. Something. 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 <laughs> okay. May I borrow your book for a while? Sure, feel free. May I take one of those cookies? Sure, feel free. May I read your newspaper? Papers. Sure, Paper. feel free. Paper. Papers. Paper. Okay. Uh -huh. Paper. May may we have lunch here? Sure, no problem. May we stay here during lunch time? Sure, no problem. May we see you after class? Sure, no problem. Mm -hmm. Who is sharing? Who is sharing the screen? Or nobody is working in this group? Teacher, I have a, a problem here in my house. Uh huh. And I can, and I can speak. Ah, uh, okay. Right now. And the other people cannot speak either. They are only connected, but they are not participating. Okay. Thank you. May I, may I take, take, take one of those cookies? Sure, feel free, go ahead. May I read, you, read your newspaper? Sure, feel free, go ahead. May we, maybe you have, have no fear? Sure, no problem. Sure, may no we, problem. May we stay here during lunch time? Sure, no problem. May we see you after class? Sure, no problem. May we get together in the hallway? Sure, no problem. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Nivel. Okay. Someone else, someone else practice? Or finish? I can try the question. May I take a picture of your food? Sure, feel free. May I use your phone? Sure, feel free. May I do the homework now? Sure, go ahead. May I ask you something? Sure, feel free. May I borrow your book uh, for a while? Sure, feel free. May I take one of those cookies? Sure, go ahead. May I read your newspaper? Sure, go ahead.
May we have lunch here? Sure, no problem. May we stay here during lunch time? Sure, no problem. May we see you after class? Sure, no problem. May we get together in the hallway? Sure, no problem. Okay. Thanks. May I go out for a moment? Sure, feel free. May I take a picture of your food? Sure, go ahead. May I use for fun? Sure, feel free. May I do the homework now? Sure, go ahead. May I ask you something? Sure, feel free. May I borrow your books for a while? Sure, go ahead. May I take one of those to those cookies? cookies? Sure, go ahead. May I read your newspaper? Sure, feel free. Excellent. May we have lunch mm -hmm. Continue. here? Mm -hmm. Next. Um... May, may, may we have lunch here? Sure, no problem. May we stay here during lunch time? Sure, no problem. May we see you after class? Sure, go ahead. May we get together in the hallways? Sure, no problem. Excellent. Thank you. Now let's go to the main session. Okay. Okay. Thank you very much for entering the groups and thank you very much for participating actively. Participation is important. That's the way we learn. If we don't participate, no, right? So, okay. When we participate, we make mistakes. Yeah, it's normal, but we learn little by little, okay? Yeah, little by little, uh -huh. Okay, let's see. Create sentences using the words provided and may or might write a, a compliment when needed. Okay. So these ones, you have to do them together. I'm not going to do these ones because these are your, this is your homework. So what you're going to do is something similar to this. This is the example. She angry at you. And you say, she might be angry at you. So you have to write complete sentences using this form. Use may or might, principally might, principally might, okay? So let's go to the groups and let's do it together, okay? 
Let's do it together. The groups are opening, please join. Okay. Eh, aquí sería he he may using may or mice. Okay. He might. He might. The verb teacher, I. Is B. The verb is B. Okay. Uh, not be he, satisfied. He might not be satisfied. Uh -huh. He might not be satisfied. Uh -huh. That's right. Oh, okay. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. And the second one is the warranty. Hey. Sea. Sí, porque yo ya ahorita dije que él no está satisfecho. Ajá, él no podría. Él. He might not be satisfied. Not be sad, satisfied. In the second, the warranty. Might. Might. Be longer. Be longer. Not be excellent. Is I may. I may. I may be longer. The warranty may be longer. The warranty may be longer. That's correct. That's correct. Only Thank you. Cap capital and P. That's it. Um. It's okay. No problem. Okay. Service <coughs> not be 
Yeah, the okay. service might not be excellent. Normally, we don't use excellent in negative. We usually use might not be good. Mm -hmm. We use excellent usually in affirmative. In negative, may, we usually may. use good. Might you not may be recommend. Good. Mm -hmm. The service might not be good. That's why people are leaving. Uh -huh. May you? No, sir. You might. You might. You might. You recommend. Might. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Might. G. Yeah. H T. Uh -huh. Yeah. You might recommend, recommend what? Recommend. You might recommend the product. You might recommend the store. You might recommend the salesperson. You might recommend. Okay. Because it's professional. Moving. You might recommend the, movie, the app. The, the movie, you might recommend the movie. Yeah, the movie. You might recommend the, the app. What's the movie? Ah. Harry <laughs> movie. Tar the Guardians. Moon. The moon. The moon. Yeah, Galaxy Guardians 3. Oh. <laughs> oh that, that's cool. <laughs> Excellent movie. Yeah. Good action. Yeah. Uh -huh. Ah, <laughs> full of action. <laughs> and it's... Star and Wars. Star Wars. <laughs> yeah. Um, only, like... <laughs> only that there isn't a Star Wars now, a new Star Wars. Only Ahsoka. <laughs> Ahsoka. <laughs> Ahsoka is a serious issue. Yeah, it's a TV series, not a movie. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's very good. <laughs> but is, okay. Ahsoka is a good... Series. Only six chapters, but it's good. Yeah. That's correct, not five and six. The waiter may be in might. a hurry. Maybe, might be. Mm -hmm. Principally, might be, but that's okay, maybe. No use. Amanda might not might not use might not nah. use what? Telephones. Yeah. Might not up? use a telephone. Okay. Amanda might not use a telephone. I think. I think don't. Mm, yeah. <laughs> might not use a cell phone. <laughs> she might use smoke signals. Smoke how, how, how do you say the eye escondida? Oh, okay. Secretly. Amanda might not use a cell phone secret. In secret. In Yahoo. In Yahoo. At work. Yeah. Okay. Uh, secret. Excellent. Chistoso, teacher. Sorry? Chistoso, how do you say? Funny. 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 Uh, funny. funny. Yeah, it's very funny. Funny. Yeah. Thank you, Blanca. Thank you, Blanca, for sharing. Yeah. Thanks, Blanca. You say the teacher has eaten payasitos. Okay. So, very funny today. Okay. Yeah. Lo usa para disimular su dolor. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you know, right? Yeah, it's difficult. It's difficult. But there we go. There we go. In, in one month, I will be better. Okay. <laughs> so, let's go to the main, the, the main uh, session. Thank you. Okay. That was a good job. So we say 
he might not be satisfied with the product. He might not be satisfied with the product. Teacher, what are, what are you writing? Nothing. Okay. Satisf satisfied with the product. He might not be satisfied with the product. The warranty. might be longer. Three, the service might not be good. Might not be good enough. People are leaving. The service might not be good enough. People are leaving. You recommend, okay, you might, you might recommend, or you might want to recommend, so you say might, you might recommend, Mm -hmm. this store. You might recommend this store to your friends. The waiter, what? Might be in a hurry. The waiter might be in a hurry. He is doing everything very fast. Amanda, what? might not use technology. Amanda might not use technology at work. She might not need it. She sells honey. She sells honey. She doesn't need technology at work. So, okay. Okay. Excellent. Now over here is says create a conversation when you are dissatisfied with a product and say what you may and might do about it. Okay. Let me see. We might not have time for that, but we're going to practice this conversation. Future possibility. Bessie and Brian. It says, what are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. I haven't decided yet. 
May I tell you later what I decide? And here is a question mark. Please, in that way, I may take. Thanks, I appreciate it. Well, it isn't every day that I have my little brother visiting me. It's very good to hear that, big sis. All right then, tell me if you need something. I will, thanks. Okay, what are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know, I haven't decided yet. May I tell you later when the, what I decide? Please, in that way I may take it. Thanks, I appreciate it. Well, it isn't every day that I have my little brother visiting me. It's very good to hear that, big sis. All right then, tell me if you need something. I will, thanks. Do you have questions about the conversation? Not question, teacher. Big no, no questions. Big sis, teacher. Sorry? Big sis. Ah, big sis is big sister. Big, big sister. Mm. Uh -huh. She is the big sis, the big sister. Mm -hmm. He's the little brother. He's the little brother and she's the big sis. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. What are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. I haven't decided yet. May I tell you later what I decide? What I decide? Please. In that way, I may take you. Thanks. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Well, it isn't every day that I have my little brother visiting me. It's very good to hear that, big sis. All right, then. Tell me if you need something. I will. Thanks. Some, something, some something, thing. something, something. something. Mm -hmm. Okay, my friends, let's go to the groups and let's practice. The groups are opening, please join. Okay. Edwin Alcon is in group one. Edwin, Alexis Perez, Cecilia, and Edgar are in group three. Okay. Okay. I can start. Sure. Um, what are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. I haven't des decided yet. May mm -hmm. I tell you later what I decide? Please. In that way, I may tell you. Thanks. I appreciate it. Well, it isn't. It isn't very that very every day. Every day that. I have a little brother visit me. It's very good to hear that, big sis. All right, then. Practices. Alguien más ahí con. Mario. Inicias tú. Okay. What are you going? To do tomorrow. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. My I tell you later what I decide. 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 What I decide. What I decide. Please. 
in that way I may take you. Thanks. I appreciate it. Well, it isn't every day that can help my little brother be sitting be sitting me. Be sitting me. Be sitting me. It's very good to hear the visits. All right. Then tell me if you need something. I will. Thanks. Finish. Okay. 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 What are you going to do tomorrow? I don't know. I haven't decided yet. May I tell you later what I decide? Please, in the way I may take you. <clears throat> Thanks. I appreciate. Well, it is every day that I had my little brother visit me. It's very good to hear that, Big Sis. All right, then tell me if you need some time. Something. I will, thanks. Thank you, Anibal. Change. Okay. I began me. Yes. Yeah. What are you going to do tomorrow? <laughs> I don't know. I haven't I haven't decided yet. Maybe I'll tell you later what I decided. Please, in that way I may take you. Thanks, I appreciate it. Well, it isn't every day that I have my little brother um visiting visiting me <laughs> visiting. Mm, it's very good to hear that big sis all right then tell me if you need something i will thank okay <laughs> <laughs> Start. <laughs> okay, what do you what do you what are you going to do tomorrow? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't know. I ah, have sí. uh, uh, I don't know. All right, let's Entonces, go back to the to the main section. Okay. 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 <laughs> okay, okay. Okay, there are 13 people present. 13 people. 15, okay. Well, I say connected. Present, I don't know. <laughs> so, sixteen. Okay, let's call the attempt. Thank you very much for participating in the groups for participating actively, for doing following all of the activities, because that's the idea. Little by little, we learn. Little by little, okay? Adán Antonio Ramírez. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Blanca del Carmen Santos. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. 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 Carlos Amílcar Campos. Present teacher. Excellent. Very good. Cecilia Maribel Alemán. Present. Okay, Cecilia. 
Daniel Enrique Sifontes. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Very good. Edgar Edilson Reyes. Okay. Edwin Alexis Perez. Present teacher. Okay. Nice. Edwin Alfredo Alcón. Present teacher. Yeah. Very good. Nice, my friend. Esmeralda del Rosario Portillo. Present teacher. Yeah, nice, very good. Eh, Gabriela Yamilés Ramírez. Present teacher. Excellent, very good. Gisela Guadalupe Martínez. Present teacher. Okay, nice. Gladys Rubidia Nieto. Present teacher. Nice, very good. Eh, Jonathan Stanles Pérez. Present teacher. Okay, great. Jose Daniel Cermeño. Jose Ernesto Alemán. Present teacher. Excellent, very good. Candy Natalia Sánchez. Mario Cristóbal Quintanilla. Mario Germán González. Present. Excellent, nice. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Present teacher. Okay, nice. Miguel Ángel Cortés. Uh -huh. Okay, good, nice, Miguelito, very good. Noé Aníbal González. Present teacher. Excellent, very good, nice. Sergio Adolfo Hernández. Present teacher. Excellent, nice, very good. Tonight... Uh, Edwin Alfredo Alcón stays with me. The other people may go home. Thank you very much for coming tonight. I will be seeing good. you tomorrow. Good night, teacher. Thank you. Good, good night. Good night, everybody. Good night, teacher. Thank you, good teacher. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Take care. Good night. Good night, teacher. Bye bye. Bye bye, Gisela. Good night. Good evening, Edwin. Good evening, teacher. What questions do you have, my friend? How can I help you? Um, for me, no question. I understand your class. Is um, is um, uh, is funny for me. Okay. And um, is um. It's a good teacher, really. Uh -huh. I I learned with you. I okay. learned a lot with you. I'm glad. I'm glad. That's the idea, my friend. Okay. Yes. Yes. It's no bored at your your class. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Okay, my friends. If you don't have any question, you may go to do the homework. So you may be advanced, and then you can go to bed early. Okay. Yes, in my home, homework in the number the second. Uh -huh. Um is in the second week. Second week, exactly. Yes. Uh-huh. Sure. Second week. All right. Then thank you for staying. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. Thank you. Good night. Take care. Good night. Sure. Good night. Writing examples of possibility. It might rain tomorrow. It might rain tomorrow. Take your umbrella.
it might rain tomorrow. Take your umbrella with you. It might be very busy. You might have to wait. for some, for a long time. He worked very hard. He is young, but still, he might be tired. She might be angry. After what happened. It might be very serious, but it's also nice and friendly. You might want to tell you something. Listen to her. He might be a little uncomfortable. But might be May I ask you something? She said her daughter might go to the party tonight. He says, his son may not play poker with us. May I see you tomorrow? Go to the party.
may read your magazine. May I look at your drawing? May I look at your drawing? May I stay after class? Possible answers? Sure. No problem. Or Okay. Yeah. Why not? Well, go ahead. May I ask you something? Sure, go ahead. She said her daughter might not go to the party tonight. He says his son may not play soccer with us. May I see you tomorrow? Sure, no problem. May I invite you to the party? Okay. May I read your magazine? Yeah, why not? May I look at your drawing? Yeah, why not? May I stay after class? Okay. <laughs> 